Hello, my name is John Haley and I am the Paint Specialist Training Manager for the W.E. Obishon Hardware Company and welcome to our first On the Road Paint Training Project. We, as a company, have participated in over a dozen Habitat for Humanity homes utilizing each opportunity as a field training for our paint specialists. Those projects were for primarily interior with our focus on interior preparation and paint products with application techniques demonstrated along the way. We intend to provide the same training aspects with our new adventure. The project we are undertaking this time is an exterior, which exemplifies many of the conditions that are often presented to us as paint specialists. Peeling paint, weathered wood, dirt and pollen are all common denominators that require a concerted effort to correct. Water drainage, the surrounding landscape, and the season are also important to consider when determining a course of action for an exterior project. Understanding these environmental and surface conditions will better direct our advice to our customers. Our project, which we will refer to as the barn, is located in beautiful Westminster, Massachusetts. The original house on this property was built in 1770 by Solomon Garfield, who was the great-grandfather of James A. Garfield, the 20th President of the United States. It's mid-October, the air is crisp and dry, and the forecast has afforded us a small window to complete this complex exterior restoration. The property owners have agreed to our course of action and to participate in all phases of our service. What is course of action? Project evaluation and estimation of products are critical in preparing for an exterior project of this nature. Square footage, the surface to be treated is critical factors when determining the quality of primer and paint products required. Substrate conditions will dictate the course of action for surface preparation. This project will afford us the opportunity to demonstrate many techniques such as power washing, mechanical sanding, scraping and grinder use. These demonstrations will also focus on safety throughout all phases of our work. Primer recommendations and selections were based upon the condition of the substrate, not price point. Mad Dog Dura Primer was chosen as the priming system for this barn. We will thoroughly review this unique bonding primer with dialogue and demonstration. The top coats chosen, Aura Exterior Low Luster, were determined by the need for durability and protection. Application technique is completely reviewed with our Titan Spray Training, which is incorporated in this training series. Our spray and back brush demonstration with proper pressure and tip selection will also be presented. Final details with artistic finishes of wood graining the barn doors and painting all hardware black will bring the barn back to life for many years to come. With the exception of the lift, all the products and tools used throughout this project are readily available at your local Obishon hardware store. Thank you to Mad Dog Primers for their generous donation of Dura Primer. And thank you to our partners at Benjamin Moore for their continued support by donating the Aura Exterior Low Luster to protect the barn here in Westminster, Massachusetts. If you have any questions throughout this training series, please contact your team, or you can always reach out to me directly at john.haley at obishan.com. <laughs>